Hey guys, it's Annabelle. So we are 11 weeks pregnant with baby number four. Um, I wanted to tell you how this last week has gone. It was another busy week. Um, we actually had our family vacation this weekend, and so that went well. Um, but being busy and being away from home also brought on um, me feeling not well. Um, this is the worst that I have felt so far. I've been tired this whole time and things like that, but I have had a super increase with not feeling well. Um, and I have noticed that it has a lot to do with the amount that I drink and the amount that I am eating. If I don't get enough water, I instantly know because my head starts to um, like throb and hurt and I start to feel nauseous and if I don't eat consistently um, and like have something in my stomach at all times, I have the, this growing nausea and I can just feel it coming on and then I get a pounding headache and it's, I have to eat. And with being gone and away from home, my meals were spaced out um, farther than what they are when I'm at home and so like this whole last week has brought an increase in me not feeling well and it was just not fun. We had a busy week again, it went by so fast. Um, I'm so very excited, I have an appointment this Friday so hopefully we get to hear this little one. Um, if, as I said in my last video, we did not get to hear the heartbeat at my last appointment because my uterus is tilted back, everything else looked good, so we did set up a, an appointment for in two weeks, so I do have an appointment this Friday. So I'm very excited about that. Hopefully we will be able to hear the heartbeat with the Doppler in the office. Um, if we don't get to hear a heartbeat with the Doppler, I'm gonna have an ultrasound. So I'm, I'm excited either way. Either we get to hear it with the Doppler or I get to see this little one with an ultrasound. Um, I have not had any loss of symptoms or any cramping or bleeding or anything like that. Um, I, I am confident at this point that everything is okay. Um, it still weighs heavily in the back of my mind that we haven't heard the heartbeat yet. Um, we were gone, so I haven't been able to sit down with my Doppler that I have here at home and kind of search around for this little one. I am going to be doing that um, this week, see if I can hear something here at home first before my appointment. So that is what I'm going to be doing. Um, and so where I'm at right now is just kind of dealing with symptoms. Um, I'm tired and I'm, I'm getting used to that more and more with the weeks that passed. I'm getting used to being tired, um, which has been consistent with all of my pregnancies. Um, I have had like splitting headaches and I have been on the verge of taking something for them. Um, I don't deal well with headaches when it feels like the pain is right in front of me. Um, I don't deal well with that, but I've been holding off. I haven't taken any medication or anything like that. Um, I just choose not to. And just trying to deal with headaches and with nausea. Um, I was without my lemon water while we were on vacation, so I saw a definite... Um, or noticed the the how much I do rely on my lemon water here at home. So I started that right away when we got back home and I am feeling better and everything is going well and we will have an exciting update for you guys next week hopefully. I'm keeping my fingers crossed. I'm still doing a lot of um, like meditating and trying to keep myself calm and plus with three kids, husband, house and work, I am busy, busy, busy. So we are going to get right into that again this week since we are back from vacation. Um, it was some overdue rest and relaxation that was definitely needed for the entire family. So we had fun this week and it kind of again got my mind off of things. Besides the increase in negative symptoms, um, I am doing well. Um, so anyways, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. Otherwise, I will see you guys next week for another update. Bye guys.